This is the nation's coolest. coolest, coolest, coolest. Cool 97 FM. This, this is Entertainment 97. Entertainment 97. Welcome to Entertainment 97. For the love of music, information, reviews, the movies, and the party scene. Entertainment 97. Coming up, local news highlights, entertainment flashback in 60 seconds, and check this out. Good afternoon, I'm Lisa Rowe, and this is Entertainment 97. In local entertainment news, Down Sound Records has launched a new reality show titled Dance Hall Life. The Fresh Show is broadcast on Kingston Signal's official YouTube channel and its first episode is already trending at number two on the streaming platform. Dance Hall Live features Spice's three former backup dancers, Rebel, TC and Pretty, who were said to be the perfect fit for the launch of the show. The show will also enable viewers to get familiar with the women as they take a deep dive into the dance hall culture and what makes them so dedicated to it. Entertainment 97. In international entertainment news, the World and Entertainment Fraternity continues to mourn the untimely passing of Earl Simmons, popularly known as DMX. The late rapper passed away last Friday. Condolences and tributes continue to pour in from fans and loved ones. DMX's autobiography titled E-A-R-L, Earl, the autobiography of DMX, has also returned to the Amazon bestsellers list days after his death. The book was first released in 2003 and was billed as DMX's memoirs, with the title a play on both the rapper's real name, Earl Simmons, and an acronym for Ever Always Real Life. Like DMX, the book is inspirational and motivating as it tells the story of the dark journey of a boy who became a man, then the man who became an artist, and the artist who became a true icon. Say what's up to everybody, you know what I'm saying? I, I... I love the support, you know what I'm saying, the continued support. they have been riding with me from day one, you know what I'm saying? Ups, downs, good, bad, and I appreciate it, you know what I'm saying? Information Reviews. This week's entertainment flashback in 60 seconds continues to pay tribute to the life and work of the iconic duo, Sly and Robbie. The drum and bass duo took part in the launch of Lee Perry's Black Art Studio and made up the core of the Upsetters band. So I was playing at a club, skin flesh on board. So Sly sit down on the drum, tack a tap. I'm saying, hmm, drum my bad and I'm going to use him. And then Peter Tosh band now, I was in charge of putting the band together. And when we're on tour and play, and we run out a song, Sly and Robbie, we just stay and start make up dub song and everything, and people say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, they don't want to hear no more of Peter, they want to hear Sly and Robbie. <laughs> Working over the years, Sly and Robbie had carefully put aside every penny they could until they finally started their own label, Taxi. They produced several new Jamaican artists for their taxi label, including Elephant Man and Bujubantan. Sly and Robbie even revamped their 1982 instrumental song, On Metered Taxi, for the iconic hit Driver by Bujubantan. Taxi produced many albums from the 1970s to now, including the Reggae Power and Meet Bonnie Lee at Dub Station. The duo says in their lifetime they may have performed and created over 200,000 songs as their label continued to pick up from its debut, 60s, 70s and 80s equals Taxi, which appeared in 1981, more and more albums were being released from the incredible Rhythm Twins. God give, give you a gift. When you get life, you get, that's a gift you get from God. When you get music in, of, that we can play, it, it's a gift from God. Slayer Robbie is a gift from God to the people. A flood of albums appeared during the rest of the decade and early 2000s, one of which was Friends that took the Grammy home out of all their other nominations. Sly and Robbie later worked with Horace Andy and international artists Britney Spears and Paul McCartney. And that's your quick bite for this week. Catch us again, same time, same place, for a continuation of this epic entertainment flashback in 60 seconds. Entertainment 97. 
Go Check Out Unbroken by reggae star Jamil. The track was released on January 15 of this year, but we believe this single can provide you with some inspiration for your weekend. The singer pelts the lyrics of overcoming hardships, which many of us can relate to. So if you haven't already, check out Jamil's Unbroken. Still unbroken, though I've been through many things. Floating over me and miss. Cool 97 FM urges you to continue following COVID-19 rules put in place for your safety. That's it for Entertainment 97. I'm Lisa Rowe. Thanks to technical producer Norman Marsh and producer Abigail Wilson. If you missed it, catch it anytime on cool97fm.com and click on the Cool TV tile. Join us again next Friday inside Cool Rhythms for more Entertainment 97.